What's up YouTube? Hey, how y'all doing? Today this video is going to be about an unboxing and then a little bit of thermal check just before and after cleaning the PC. So that's what I got for you. Um, we got some more gaming stuff coming out soon. You know, if you're not subscribed yet, please get subscribed. I'd really appreciate it. Like the video down below if you, if you actually like the content and then suggest anything down in the comments below if you'd like to see something new. So here we go without further ado. So we have is the Meco compressed air duster. I bought this because I got tired of buying the spray bottles. Uh, it's corded, so I'm sorry about the vibrations. I have a weird setup here. All right, so let's open her up. See what we get in the box. This just should cut down on using those canisters to air and all that. Uh, there was good reviews on it. I've seen some other channels. Get some nozzles in here. Oh, different types of nozzles. And they're all connected. Look at that. Pretty cool. Let's take out the whole Oh my goodness. That's actually pretty heavy. Pretty fancy. The Mecco. Pretty neat. Uh, looks like two settings on it. One, two. And we'll have to try it out later. See how it blows out the computer. We're going to use this to clean all our electronics. I uh, got a couple little dust filters in there. A little bristled brush. A little bristled brush. Vacuum tip. Plenty of little tips. We'll open up the tips in a second. I'll just pull them all out. A uh, nice little fan tip. Flat tip, I should say. Flat vacuum tip. Uh, focused air nozzle. And uh, a dust blower. Cyclone cleaning. Hey, it's a user manual. I'm pretty sure I know how to use a, a vacuum, so this is just reversed. <laughs> All right, let's get that box out of here. Okay, so what you get in the box is you get the Mecco itself. And we'll open up all these little units here. See what we got. So it's a nice little tight tip there. Can you even see it? Oh, it's focused down here. So cool, fine tip there. A nice little bristle brush. Um, Plastic bristles. Shouldn't conduct any electricity if you have to brush something. And yeah, we're just throwing all the trash to the side, doesn't matter. That's less focused tip. Looks like a step down for these. Nope, that's the other one. This one right here. That's like a big blower area. This one right here. This is gonna be the one you can attach these to, huh? No? Where do they go? Oh no, read the instructions, right? <laughs> Kidding, we're not gonna do that. Why would we ever read instructions for a blower? All right, let's test fit some of these. So it looks like they do have locking mechanisms on the side of it. Um, some of the reviews said it does blow so powerful. This one comes off, so we'll have to test that out and see if it actually comes off or not. Um, boy, that's on there pretty good though. I don't see how they would come off. Oh my goodness. There we, oh, you gotta really yank it. Hey, that's got a good hold. Okay, so where do these tips go? They must go on this one. That yeah, was right. Oh, they do go on pretty snug though. I do see these being a problem because there's no lock on that. That would just pop off. So the review said this one, as well as these guys. That looks like a little side blower tip. So it comes through and then blows out the sides. Um, these were popping off also it blows so powerful so i can see having to hold that while you're blowing it out and then the dust filter goes in the bottom a little dust filter there pretty cool hey it passed inspection can you see that that's good to know that's good to know that it passed inspection <laughs> but two more filters uh these seem washable so i might be able to wash those but yeah so that's the miko air duster i think it was like 45 50 bucks there'll be a link down in the description if you want to check it out I did buy it from Amazon. This was months ago. So I haven't, <clears throat> I haven't cleaned out my PC in months, obviously, because of that. But I do have removable dust filters because it's a Nano S. So, I don't know, pretty cool set. All right, thanks for watching the unboxing. Let's check out the performance of it.
So the reason I did the Mecco unboxing was because I'm going to clean out my computer and then I want to test, test the uh, CPU cooler performance because I have two fans on it. I have the 140 and then the 120. It's a D15, NHD 15S. And I want to make sure that if I remove that front fan, it still cools the same. So I'm just like baseline, like baseline benchmarking with the, the current setup. So that's the reason with the Nano S. I mean, you can barely see it, but that's the reason with the Nano S. Um, the cooler size works for the D15S because it's a 3900X. So I just want to make sure. So we're running the running the Ida 64 trial version at this point just to get a baseline, and then I'll you know I'll screenshot it. We're doing a 10 minute run, and I'll show you before and after temps just so you can see after cleaning out all the dust and everything, how it performs, if it made a difference, uh, because my filters are dirty right now too. So I'm gonna vacuum those off and blow them off with the new Mecco. And then uh, we'll see how it performs, just to see if it makes any difference, because you wanna keep your kates clean, like, cause dirt and stuff, if you get the wrong things in there, it can short it out. So yeah, just some fun stuff to do. I got the new M50 camera, so I'm just playing with it. We'll, we'll check back after this is done. As you can see, before cleaning, it, really, it didn't really do too bad. And I cleaned it out, and then we had some decent temps the first time. And then after cleaning, I didn't really notice a change because it seems like my case wasn't either really that dirty or it just didn't matter that much because I have so many fans in there. There was a little bit of dirt on the front of the case, a little bit of dust inside. There's really like not much dust left after blowing it out. So I guess all in all, um, cleaning at least every six months should keep your PC running smoothly. So that's the results. Kind of interesting that, you know, even though my vent on the front of the screen was really pretty blocked, I blew out a lot of dirt. Uh, it didn't really make a difference. Because I do have two 140s in the front, 120 exhaust, and then a really substantial CPU cooler. So, not a big deal. So, thanks for watching the video.